It's your boy John Henry, aka J Hen. Welcome to the podcast experience. Hey y'all, it's Amber, and welcome to the podcast experience. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Aiden. You can call me AG. And it's the podcast experience. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the podcast experience. I'm Adrian. I'm Johnny. I'm Jamarcus. And today we got Jamarcus. And we're going to do a little QA with Jamarcus. We're going to get inside his head about the baseball world. So, how you doing today, Jamarcus? Doing good, man. Living life. That's good. That's, that's good. Life. That's good. Let's yeah. see another day. That's good. That's good. You want to tell the people a little something about yourself? Um, I'm Jamar- My name is Jamarcus. They call me J Lang. I'm a right hand pitcher. From, I'm originally from here, Hattiesburg, Mississippi. I play for the <laughs> Texas Rangers. Right here on this shirt, right here. And his hat right there. Yes, That's sir. Right yes, here, sir. I got drafted last year out of junior college. I went to Mississippi Gulf Coast. Then I ended up transferring to Inter- Enterprise State Community College. Got drafted late round, like 37 round. Something like that. 37 yeah. round. Yeah. I had a little altercation at school. And kind of like push my draft stop back, but yeah, but as they say, minor setback for a major company, yeah, no doubt. Because, no like, the hardest to me, the hardest thing is getting drafted once you're in there, like, once you're in the form system, mm-hmm. the only place you can go is up unless you unless you get injured, yeah, and it's like a career ending injury. Uh-huh. Other than that, you can go up. Yeah. I, I got a question, I'm gonna take you backwards. So let's go back to you. What did you start off with? What, what was your first? When you realize this is baseball, this is what I want to do, and then when you realize that I want to be a pitcher, man, I started out. You remember uh, Timberton Park? Yeah, yeah. When when it was up before the uh, tornado hit, I started out there. My mom used to walk me down to the park early in the morning from my grandma's house. I started out there, then I ended up going to Tatum, mm-hmm. play with Le- at Larry Doliac Field. Then in high school, in high school I mainly played shortstop. Like, I ain't never going nobody want to just be a pitcher. Mm-hmm. Then I ended up going to junior college, and, they, and they were, he was like, um, you got an arm on you, so I think you should be a pitcher. I was like, nah, I ain't going to do that. Do that. <laughs> so then he did. No lie. He recruited me to be a shortstop. Right. But in his head, he knew he was going to make me a pitcher. Right. Mm-hmm. So when I got there, he was just like kind of like avoid me being a shortstop. Like, I was steady trying to get out there, like get more reps. Mm-hmm. And he was like, nah, nah, nah. And then I ended up getting on the mound, slaying that thing. <laughs> slaying. And then people just were like, you just need to be a pitch. Then I talked to a pro scout, a couple of them. They were like, you need to stick your main focus on pitch. Yeah, but back, back when you pitched in Hasbro High, you almost threw a no hitter, though. Yeah, I did. Yeah. <laughs> you know who we played, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, man. Uh, yeah, yeah, no hitter. That's true, man. No hitter, no hitter. Yeah, that's right. You, once you had that under your belt, shoot, can't nobody take it away from you. That's history right there. The last out. Yeah, the, the last, last out. Time. It was a drop by uh, Joe, Joe Gray. Gray. Come on, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out, Joe. Shout out, Joe. Joe, Joe got drafted as well. Yeah. He played for the Milwaukee Brewers. Good yeah, deal. Yeah. Yeah. And the team that you played for at Hasbro High, I mean, what, three people got drafted out of that club? Yeah, me, Dexter Jordan. And Joe Gray. Joe Gray. And the year you played, y'all almost won a state championship. Yep. My senior year. Yeah. But then after you left, they yeah. won a state championship. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah. I might have been the curse. <laughs> <laughs> but the thing about it, in Hattiesburg, you know, of course, we never won a state championship in football. So baseball kind of been our bread and butter. So mm-hmm. when you come from Hattiesburg, being a baseball player, kind of genetics. You know what I mean? But having said that, what who's some of the people that inspired you, you know, uh, coming up? Like, like who who you look up to? Whether it be family, or baseball mom, player. That's the, I'll talk my mom. Yeah. Cause she worked hard. Mm-hmm. It's way too hard. <laughs> you, you know. Yeah. <laughs> she don't work. That's one thing about her, she don't work. Mm-hmm. Then I always wanted I can't say nobody in this, like sports. Mm-hmm. Well, baseball, no. Mm-hmm. Cause I used to want to play basketball, but I tried to quit baseball and play basketball. One of my coaches. Oh, Coach Story. You probably don't know Coach Story. Yeah, I know Story. Yeah. Coach, Coach Story still coach, no? Nah, Coach Story just a, he a doctor now. Okay, okay. Coach Story inspired me though, cause yeah. I wanted to quit baseball so many times. He just kept telling me, "I'll just play, just play." I was like, "No, I want to play basketball." Cause I started dunking. <laughs> so I started almost dunking. 
I just felt like I just wanted to play basketball. Mm -hmm. Coach Thornton inspired me. I say my high school coach, Joe Hartfield, inspired me. He inspired me mm -hmm. a lot. He really humbled me because that state championship game when I sat on the bench. Yeah. I was a crybaby. <laughs> so he used to see me a lot. So when I got to college and I started like seeing a little bit, I was already used to it. Right. So I had ended up teaching him one day like, I appreciate you for seeing me during that state championship. Back then in high school, I didn't see you. You understand? Yeah, yeah, I was really mad at him. That's your maturity, though. Yeah. 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 That's yeah. Cool. Take you growing up to realize that. That's about it. Yeah. What's so, well, tell me about, let's move on to the way you're at now. How is it now? Is it, is it a big difference between college ball and, yeah. uh, and baseball? Yeah, yeah. It's, man, it's, 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 like, faster, it's like playing baseball and not going to school and even getting paid to play baseball. Mm -hmm. It's fun. Okay, I say, I can give you all my schedule. Mm -hmm. All right. We'll wake up like 11 o'clock. Eat breakfast. They they kind of make it. Well, they don't make us eat breakfast, but they give us a chart. Where we gotta mark off what we eat. Mm -hmm. We gotta eat this much a day, like to get more calories so we can get bigger. So right. I'm on the lookout. They want me to get bigger. Right. Mm -hmm. And then around twelve o'clock, we'll go work out. Then by one o'clock, we'll go throw. Then they'll give us like a two and a half hour break. Then mm -hmm. we gotta play at night. We do the same thing every day. We play wow. a full game. You have any practice class? in the morning, play at night. You have any class any time? Or? Oh, we do have a class. We got Spanish class. Spanish? Yes, yeah. I got wow. Spanish class. Wow. Okay. And then the Dominicans, uh -huh. Dominicans, they take English class. Oh, wow. So you have Dominicans. Your team is like a melting pot. Yeah, I, I went. I ended up going to the uh, Dominican in October. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. I, was, I went for like, how long? Like two weeks. Like two weeks. How yeah. was it? Man, like a compound? It's big, yeah. <laughs> they had us in the, see, they really didn't want us to leave because they said it's like danger down there. Mm -hmm. We ended up leaving one time though. I like, they live different from us. Yeah. yeah. Like way different. Uh -huh. It's a culture shock. Yeah. 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 No yeah. police down there. No police? No police. <laughs> Man, I, seen, I seen one motorcycle. It was four people on one motorcycle. <laughs> it sounded unrealistic on me. It does. Yeah. But I can believe it. They, they have, they're a little poor down there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but you know, in baseball, you know, it's more uh, Spanish players, Spanish oh, yeah, players they, than it is. Oh, they're they're good. good, you know. They're trying to get out of where they at to do better for their family. Mm -hmm. yeah. Good, I, I get it, I get it. And what's your goal? What's your goal to make it to the major? What time frame are you giving yourself? Because I know I, I, I see you working, you're stay, working hard. Yeah, if I can stay healthy, I, I say four years, four years, yeah, three or four. Coronavirus puts you back some, yeah, because right now. It like right now it's a young it's a young guy moving. You get what I'm saying? Like mm -hmm. all the young they trying to get all the young guys up there so we can get the plan. Yeah, right. So like I just feel like if I just work, just keep working. Mm -hmm. I say about four years. I see uh, uh what's his name? Uh Anthony Alpha. Oh Anthony Alpha. He played yeah, for the Pirates right. now. Yeah. He got traded from yeah. the Blue Jays. Did he did he get hurt? I, I, yeah, he yeah. did get hurt recently. He, he broke something. I forgot what it was. He'll be bad. We wish him a speedy recovery. Oh, yeah, yeah, most definitely. Yeah. Yeah, you know, gotta represent for the home team. No doubt, no doubt. And DeMarcus Evans from Pell. Okay. Yeah. You yeah. know him? Mm-hmm. Yep. He on the uh 60 man right now for the Texas Rangers. All he doing, waiting on them to say, come throw. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's my I mean, you know, stick with it. You get that, you go far, you know what I mean? Because right now it's a shortage on African Americans in the baseball yeah, community, so you know to see one of ours, especially homegrown, hometown, make it, you know, it's always a blessing. You know what I mean? So you gotta stick with it. You know, and you know more definitely, I'm gonna be coming to check you out for sure. As soon as you send me some tickets, both of y'all. <laughs> both of y'all stand on the stand, get paid back up. Okay. Uh -huh. um, okay. Yeah, you plan on doing any kind of training camps for the youth? You know, you gotta give back to the community. I plan on it not right now though. Yeah, I'm planning on. It. The wrong right yeah, sometime kind of. next year. Yeah. yeah. It's gonna be free. Okay. Oh, hey, good yeah. deal. Yeah. Yeah. Make sure it's free. You gotta make sure it's free for the for the kids. Cause yeah. you got I mean, you got you the youth looking up to you. When they hear the name Jamarcus Lane, you know, you in role model status now. Mm -hmm. Whether you wanna be or not. You know, that's just what it is. You know, people they kinda gravitate towards athletes a whole lot better than just ordinary people, but that's a blessing, though. Yeah, it, it is, is a blessing. Is. You, know, you know what I mean? You got a platform now. 
Tell me about, do you have a, I heard you won a championship already. Yeah, we won the championship, okay. it was the Arizona League. I still haven't got my ring yet, to be honest. Okay. I, when I go up there next week, I know I'm getting my ring and I'm gonna bring it back. Okay. okay. But yeah, we won. Yeah, well, definitely. Yeah, yeah. Just that you got a ring. Yeah, yeah. I, told, I, told, I, told, I know he won the championship, but I, I don't know. But I'll be that ring, you know. If you had it already, you got to show the hard way on camera. That thing ain't nice. <laughs> I can imagine. That thing ain't nice. You got to see it. Yeah. Uh, can you hit? A little bit. <laughs> like, I right, sometimes, like, say if I pitch like a big game mm -hmm. or a shutout, they'll let us do like pitches BP. Mm -hmm. So all the pitches, whoever did good that game, they get to hit. Okay. Just for fun. Mm -hmm. Hit a few out. Yeah. Okay. Like yeah. two or three. <laughs> <laughs> well, what was your pitching speed? Uh, before I left, I hit ninety five. Oh wow. S but consistently, I see it like ninety ninety three, eighty nine ninety three. What was your best pitch? What's the pitch? Your go to pitch? Like bad ball. Bad ball. You gotta be. Okay. I ain't gonna lie. I look, to me. When, well, see, when they asked me that question, they asked me that same question. I told them slap because it's a white guy. Like. I feel like if I get an O2 count, mm -hmm. nobody gonna hit my slot. Mm -hmm. Even though it do get hit, but that's how I feel. That's how you feel, right? And, and they, feel and they like was just that. saying, like, your fastball, your primary pitch, so why not make it your main pitch? Like, that's your go to. Yeah, yeah. that's your bread and butter right there. Yeah. Yeah. Especially if you're throwing in the 90s. Yeah. Well, yeah. nowadays, to be honest, nowadays, the athletes we got right now, man, they turn 100 miles per hour around. Why? Mm -hmm. like, you throw 100. Over the gate. Yeah. Oh, boy, he, yeah, yeah. He. That's right, because uh, Rodgers Chapman, that used to be his bread and butter, but he been getting rocked here lately. <laughs> Damn. Oh, you know, that's what he got. Get, he get more strike out than he is, though. But yeah, he do. He's he doing he but, but the thing about it, I guess, with the velocity of the ball, because uh, it don't take much to hit it out the park. No. The no. harder you throw it. Fast they come, yeah. harder they go. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Because, see, whenever he throw a 100 mile per hour fat ball, it seems like when they connect with it, it's out the park. Yeah, yeah. You know, you know just stick the bed out there. Yeah, they going out. You see it. Mm hmm. You got rock. I ain't, I, actually, I haven't got hit over here. I done got hit off the top of the fence twice. I ain't got hit over yet. Yeah. I like that. I like saying that. <laughs> Not a lot of people can't say that. Yeah, I'm say keep it that way. I know. Uh -huh. Some of my teammates get hit out. I can say it. Yeah. I never got hit out yet. Yeah. <laughs> so, so what? What? It, so for the, the younger viewers that's watching, who wants to be a baseball player or a pitcher, what? What's an advice you can give them, or something you can tell them to help them get to the next level? Yeah. Like you did. Keep grinding. Don't never let nobody tell you what you can't do. I was in a situation, my man's know right here. I was in a situation where I was not supposed to get drafted to be honest. I'm being dead serious. The year 2019 was a bad year for me. And I still ended up getting drafted. You just gotta stay to the court, stick to the court. Don't give up. Yeah, we've heard that several times. <laughs> uh, same yeah. same words, you know what's so crazy? Mm -hmm. I heard that so many times, I never believed it. Like I, got, like, I get tired of hearing it. Like, mm -hmm. stick to the court, stay, like, just stay right there, just keep grinding. I got tired of hearing it. But when it when it actually happened to me, yeah, I understood it. Yeah, that's, that's, that's what it don't take. It don't take mm -hmm. for it for it to happen to you for you to understand that you really gotta just keep grinding and just stay there. That's it, that's it. Yeah. 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 Patience is a virtue. Yeah. 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 Good thing come to those who wait. You know, that's, that's true. true. That's so true. so when you put in the time, put in the work, be patient. You know, don't get distracted. You know what you're good at. You know what you made of, you know your talent. You've been Edits and T-ball, you know what I mean? So you already knew it was bound to happen. You know, it's just perfect time. Mm -hmm. You know, God time. Yeah. No doubt. You know, okay, you know, feel, time. And then I feel like this was meant for me. Yeah. If, if all that happened in 2019, I still got drugs, I feel yeah. like this life was meant for me. That's right. I be thinking about this. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Life might be meant for me. Yeah, it's meant for you. It's meant for you. You know, we got to make the best of it. Okay, let's, let's say when you, when, when not yet, when you make it to that level, mm -hmm. Well, what you want to do? You know, I want to invest in stuff like I want to get like at least two trucks, two eighteen wheelers, mm -hmm. a barbershop most mm day. -hmm. I gotta get a barbershop. Uh, I want to rent out a couple houses, turn them into Airbnb. I just want to have other money coming in just in case. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, in case. Constant income. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Constant income. yeah. That's smart. Invest your money. Yeah, you gotta you gotta have smart investment because I've seen so many people. Blown out. Yeah, I know. saw some of Mike. Was it Mike Tyson? Yeah, yeah. probably was. Somebody, <laughs> somebody blew a hundred million. Yeah, a lot of athletes. A hundred million. I think it was Mike. 
I oh, think what? it was Mike Tyson. I don't what know. Wow. Oh, and mm-hmm. T Pain. It was somebody. It was a rapper, a boxer. I know AI. You know, they, a couple people run into them financial, you know, downfalls and stuff like that. And then over time, they had to pick themselves back up. Mm-hmm. But once they you develop a name, you know what I mean? It's, you know, it ain't hard to get back on track. Sure. You know what I mean? Like, like, like yeah, people gonna yeah. always want, want you once you build your brand up. So, you know, I know that's what you're doing right now, kind of just building your brand yeah. up and stuff like that. And, so um, I can always be out there, have a good resume. That's right. Well, yeah. well tell me this, um, with, with, um, do, do they provide people there to help you, you know, financially wise to manage your money at, at this level or that's the next level? Or do they do that? Yeah, they, I mean, they give us like a class um, to take so they can teach us about financial stuff, but um, it's optional. Okay. Oh, it's, yeah. not, it's not required. No, it's not required. At the end of the day, it's show money. It, that's that's money. true. That you is know, true. You're going to do it. You're going to do it. Yeah, yeah that's right. But, you know, Revenge wise, yeah. but you already got a plan. Yeah. That's where it started. You gotta have a plan, then execute. You know what I mean? And right now, you already part of local legends like Larry Williams. You know what I mean? Like I said, you said, Dexter, Joe Gray. Yeah. You know, other baseball greats like Perfect. Robert. Yeah. You know what I mean? Rob, Robert's, Robert's still playing right now, ain't he? I think yeah, so. he'll play Mexico. So. Last I said, he Robert was Carson? Yeah, Robert Carson. Yeah, he, might, yeah, I think he was pitching over in Mexico. So, you know, that, that's another avenue because some people don't always make it to the majors. I ain't saying I'm claiming that you're going to make it. You know what I mean? Because that's the ultimate goal. But, you know, they say, God forbid, fall short. What, what's your plan after that? You going to go into coaching or? Most definitely coach. Yeah. I really see if that don't work, I'm going to go back to school because, like, they give you a certain amount of money. So, like, when you're done playing baseball, you got two years to go to school. Okay. And I want to, I really want to major in architecture. Okay. okay. I just got to expand my, I feel like I got to expand my brain somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it takes like some real talent. Yeah, do it, do Yeah, you got to be into That's a word, yeah. <laughs> art, math. Art, yeah. 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 Yes. yeah, because of architecture, you see beautiful buildings like the Empire State Building. Or like that new uh, LA arena I watched last night. Uh, Ooh, that thing, that thing's nice. nice. Oh man! It's Talking about the one they beat the Cowboys in. The one they slaughtered the Cowboys. Mm-hmm. The one they slaughtered the Cowboys in. <laughs> but yeah, shout out to the Rams. Shout out to the Rams shout too. Third to half. Oh, shout out to them Saints. <laughs> I guess we all win a week. Yeah, uh, everybody won. Let's we'll see how we two go. Yeah, we two. Are you a Rams fan? No, no, no. I'm a Bears fan. Bears. I like the Bears. Oh, who's your favorite NFL team? Saints. Who that nation? Who that? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I thought I thought a uh, pretty boy Tom was gonna hand it to y'all yesterday, but no. Nah. New team. New team, and then Gronk. Well, he had Gronk twice. And he in another division. That yeah. division mm-hmm. he was playing in. Yeah, it was weak. One of the weakest divisions it is. You got the Dolphins. Uh, you got yeah. the Bills. Yeah. Exactly. And you got the. Look uh, who the Pages played for a week. Uh, Dolphins. Yeah. Easy win. Yeah. Cam looked good though. Yeah, he did. I yeah. thought Cam looked good. I'm rooting for Cam. I, I am. Too. Yeah, I'm me too. I ain't a Patriots fan, but, but I, I, I root for Cam. Yeah, I'm rooting for Cam too. Yeah, yeah. he faced some adversity. I'm just worried about this, this new style. Is they gonna keep that up, or he gonna go back? I have to. Yeah, because he can't hold up with that run all year. They yeah, but you know, but that was better check. But that was. They implemented it. Yeah. Everybody had two runs from TD. Yeah. And then design yeah. one plays. Yeah. yeah. I think I think that's how they're going to cut. To be honest with you, we had this conversation yesterday. Me and uh, Scooter, you know, my cousin Scooter, TJ, and Big Wood. The, the way that the NFL is going, and uh, it's a dude. All right, what's his name? My boy. All right, said, recipe said. But, uh. He said a while back, he said the way the NFL is going is going to be more running quarterbacks than pocket quarterbacks. It is. It is. And you see now, with, with uh, El Freaky down, with Lamar Jackson now, that's what you got to got to kind of have now. Yeah, you got it. That's because he, he made it so. Yeah, Patrick Mahomes. Joe Burrow. Yeah. Burrow. 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 <laughs> we got Derek Carr. Come on, I can't get out of pocket. Derek Carr ain't going nowhere. He got, he got one of the quickest release, though. Yeah, yeah, that's what he he takes his time to get out the pocket, but he gonna let it go quick. See, yeah, I got to do that. I ain't yeah. never seen Derek Carr. Yeah, you should have watched this yesterday. But anyway, Are you, you know, no, I'm not really. Yeah, got to. Have to <laughs> so we got them wide out. Oh, man. He yeah. runs third before yeah. he got hurt. Yeah, I was looking two people by himself. Yeah. 
Y'all look good last year. Yeah, they did. Appreciate it. Appreciate it. Y'all did. But but like even with the Saints, once once they weave out Drew Brees, you got Tyson Hill coming in. You see what I'm saying? That's more of a running. You know, here. But what they gonna do with oh going the back? Uh, that one year. Yeah. Oh, he just dealt for sure. I forgot he was I, I, yeah, I really believe Winston, Winston, Winston on a good system, and they really just, Winston can't be that quarterback. I mean, he, he threw just as many touchdowns as he did in yeah, He did a Brett Favre thing. I mean, yeah. so everybody praises yeah. Brett, but then they look down on Winston, he did, he's doing the same thing. Yeah, that is true. I, I, think, I, I, think, I, I yeah. think they had like a plus 13 turnover uh, ratio, yes, I mean, with the Bucks last year. But that, because the Bucks had good defense, but then they, was turning the ball over a lot on offense, so it was like plus thirteen. You know what I mean? So, to me, I, don't know about me. I like I like what you just said. I think I think Jeremy Winston, cause look what Brady did yesterday with the book. It, it like it wasn't really nothing. Yeah, he threw, he threw a pick. pick. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. He, I think he threw two. Two. Yeah, he I threw two. Two picks. Yeah. yeah, but they ain't got. That's just how the book set up. Yeah, yeah. it ain't James. Yeah. I don't think it's James. Now that I see it, now that I seen what happened yesterday, I don't think it's James. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He just in a tough division. He ain't got the right people on his team. So who are your prediction to win the Super Bowl? Honest prediction. Ravens. The Ravens. Who they gonna play? The Ravens. NFC. AFC. Uh, AFC. Mm-hmm. Who they gonna play? Yeah. Ooh. I listen. <laughs> <No. laughs> I, I wanna, I wanna say the same, but every time we get in the playoffs. We blow it. Yeah. Well, I mean, this we might not be our team. We're a regular team. season team, though. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Y'all uh, might do it this year. Nah. My prediction is going to be the Raiders versus. The Ravens going to the Super Bowl. Uh, Raiders. The Ravens. <laughs> yeah, I'm, 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 I'm picking the Ravens, too, this year for the Super Bowl. Now, the mm-hmm. NFC team, I, I don't know about that. I, I'm not going to say Bears. Oh, I played I, yesterday. Uh, Y'all ain't get rid of that quarterback. Well, go yeah. he showed something the last that last drive. He threw three touchdowns in the fourth quarter. He did. Three. And two of them was some good throws. He had to put them on the money. Now, am I saying he going to be that way all season? Probably not. But he, he did all right. We had no defense yesterday either. I don't know where my defense went. Man, yeah, used to have two defense. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Play with them on, man. yeah. Mac, I don't know what Mac was doing. I guess he took a break. Yeah. I see him. He kept trying to get back to the quarterback, but I don't know what was going on. I was like, watching it on um, hey, Red Zone. Zone. Red Zone. I, I saw it was watching back and forth. Mm-hmm. And, uh, yeah, the Bears were dying. I thought y'all was out of it. I did, too. And then y'all came back. And Detroit had a chance to win that game when they threw, when no boy dropped that pass in the end zone. Yeah, because he supposed to have that. But I was pulling for y'all because I put y'all on my sheet. <laughs> that was all the reason. It was all the sheet. <laughs> That's the only reason why. I felt like y'all going to win that game, but... The way that they, I, I, you know, I hate to say this, but it probably be the Saints go to the Super Bowl out the NFC because you, if you look at the, I don't see no other team. Yeah, yeah you know, I'm sitting here thinking like, well, you look at the Eagles, they blew a 17 point lead against the Washington football the team. Eagles, right, the Eagles got talent. Yeah. But, but let's look at it this way: no preseason. Okay, no preseason this year. This is the first time they've been on the field in like real competition. Really right, right. Time to praise. Right, right, you know, so yeah, give a couple of weeks and mm-hmm. we might find a new contender coming out the NFC. Yeah. But right now, yeah, it is. It, yeah, like 49ers didn't look good. They <laughs> lost Arizona. I took Arizona. Yeah. I told I think, did I tell you that? Uh huh. Yeah, I had to. Arizona. Arizona looked good. Yeah, right? Arizona looked good. Kyle Murray looked good. Right. right. The Rams look good. Mm-hmm. I'm just thinking about, you know, they're going through the division. Cowboys, they look like they always look Cow- garbage. Slow. Yeah, real garbage. To the Cowboys fans that watch, y'all garbage. Disappointment. Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> That's all I can say. I'm so, I was, I was, I was so disappointed. You know? And then you got uh, old boy over there in Carolina, but I don't think, like I said, the same, they don't win their division Ooh, probably geez. easily. Yeah, Teddy Bridgewater, Atlanta look. Oh, Seahawks look good. Yeah, it Seahawks. might be the Seahawks. Yeah. I ain't, I ain't watch that. Who they play? They play uh, Atlanta. Mm-hmm. Slaw. Man, Atlanta needs to blow it up. They just need a quarterback. They had three receivers rush over 110 yards yesterday. Yeah. Still a lot. Mm-hmm. Time for what's a Atlanta quarterback? Or Matt Ryan. It's time for him to go. I've been to see that. I seen that two years ago. They, they, everybody still stuck on the fact that he won MVP. I don't know when that was. Uh, so yeah. well, I forgot. So see, really don't even count no more. They didn't need a new quarterback. Yeah. Who do you think going to win the World Series since, since y'all out? What the Rangers looking like this year? Oh, I was making the postseason. Not looking good. Not looking good. Not looking good. Man, I, yeah. 
But um, I, I say that. Dodgers. The Dodgers. Yeah, Dodgers. That's the most rooted team. But see, that's where you go wrong. You got to go with the underdog. Like, yeah. I say the Well, for the past Dodgers. couple years, when the, uh, I say the Padres. When the Astros cheated, they kind of, you kind of know for sure they were going to go. <laughs> <laughs> but you think the Padres? Yeah. Dead. They clutching. Man, they dead. Yeah, they, um. I think they the number one. I think they over the Dodgers right now. Yeah. Yeah. And they just picked up a, a picture from the Indians. Mike Clemens. Yeah. Tall dude with long hair. Yeah, yeah. And they yeah. already got Chris Petty. He sit 98 to 100. Then Mike Levin just sit 96 to 98. Uh, well. Then they got Manny Machado. They got Fernando Tatis, the young dude, like 21. Mm-hmm. Yeah, the dude just started. Yeah. Yeah, that, uh, was throwing that gas. Yeah. He got, he got that little, uh, what is it, a slider he got? Oh, no, no, I'm talking about Fernando. Oh, he's young. He's yeah, the tall skinny. Oh, the, nah, yeah, 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 the blood dress. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, the hill. Man, that man, nah, he like 21, 22. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And he got defense. Yeah. <laughs> he can he hit it. He rushed for MVP right now. Yeah. Yeah, it's something serious over there. Yeah, I like the five drag, man. Yeah. Okay. Well, what's the, what's the, we're going to hit every other sport. NBA. What you got, Lakers? Even though I know the Lakers not gonna win because they so hyped up. Why you say that? What well, Lakers? I don't even like the Lakers, but I, I think they gonna win. Either. Well, they, I'd say they take the West, but it depends on who come out the East. Matter of fact, the Lakers my favorite team. But I want y'all to remember me saying that the Celtics gonna win the whole thing. Okay. I watched them play. I was I was going against the Celtics with the Raptors, but uh, man, they look like they, they move fast. Yeah, yeah, they, yeah they, you got Mark Smart, Jason Tatum, yeah, Kemba Walker. Yeah. That's a deadly three. Then you got the tall white dude. Yeah, that's man, mm-hmm. that man grabbing everything. Yeah, oh, uh, but that's that's what's gonna take. And Gordon Hayward out. You got Gordon Hayward out. Come back, he's old. Yeah, yeah. but uh, I think they're gonna beat Miami. Boston gonna beat Miami. But you got AD on the tail right now. That's true. That's true. <laughs> and, and, and I like AD. I, I really yeah, want to see him I like AD. But I don't like the team he on, but I like AD. But, and man, my thing is, who, so you're saying, what's his name? Kaliko, whatever his name. I can't remember his name. Yeah. Uh-uh, the uh, white guy, the center. I don't know his name. I just yeah. He got a t- tattoo right here. Oh, you talking about peace? He ain't did enough. Yeah, he talking he about these. Yeah, he working. He got a low haircut. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He talking about these. He working when I see him. Yeah. He working. Uh, yeah, but AD. Yeah, AD is wrong. AD that man. <laughs> but now, if they fall like this, it's going to fall like we said. It's going to be like classic old school battle. The yeah. new school Lakers and the new school Boston. You can go all the way back to what the 80s when they had Good the big yeah. rivalries with Boston. Yeah, and the Rondo on the Lakers. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I've always liked the Rondo. I say the Lake, if not the Lakers, the Celtics. It's one of them teams down there. Yeah. The Celtics will not lose to the Heat. The, 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 no, they, I don't think they're going to lose to the so Heat. So what you saying? The, the Heat was just hot for that last series? Nah, they a good team. They hot. They hot. They still going to be hot. Mm-hmm. But uh, the cat, Boston. Man, Boston. <laughs> I, ain't, I ain't even know they was Boston with like it. I didn't know. Mm-hmm. I didn't yeah. try to watch the game. Mm-hmm. I watched them play. I said, them boys tonight. If they just keep turning on, they won't get beat by the thing, the thing with the Lakers is they that first game they uh, they kind of feel out yeah, who they, they, their opponent they and then they smart. make adjustments that they have too because so they got they, the talent. They did it the last series. Yeah, yeah. They they lost the first one. Yeah, so yeah, both of them against but, Portland. They lost the first one, so I win. But even with uh, what's the name of them, they choke a lot. I hate to say Houston. How many times Houston been in that position and choke? Yeah, but see, they played a small ball and then the Lakers adjusted to it. Yeah, they did. So, you know. They, but, all right, but I know we're going to move forward, but who y'all got in this game seven? Out of uh, Lakers and uh, Nuggets, a comeback team. Yeah, they are, uh, but I'm, I'm, I'm saying my, my man Kawhi, he's going to pull it out. They ain't going to let the Clippers win. You don't think so? That's where the money everybody wants to see the Clippers play. The Lakers, yeah. They want to yeah, see them yeah. play the Lakers. I, I There's no way the Nuggets can I don't think they, I don't think the world gonna let the niggas win. Because <laughs> everybody want to see the Lakers in the clip. Yeah, I do. I mean, I want to see. Me too. Mm-hmm. I don't want to but, see that. But I've been pulling for the Nuggets lately because they've been nine three one. See, they the total opposite. The Lakers start out lose the first game and they win the next four. The Nuggets start out lose the first three and uh, fall out one, one <laughs> three and one, then they come back and win three in a row. Yeah. It's gonna be a good series. I got Nuggets winning against the Clippers. I'm, I'm over with the Clippers. Like Kawhi and Paul George. Yeah. yeah. 
Niggas is cold to spread. They gonna hate money. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Yes, indeed. Okay, then. I well, we appreciate you being on, Jamar. I appreciate y'all having me, man. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed, man. Anytime. Yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Uh, as usual, like, subscribe, comment. I'm missing something. Like, follow. And follow. Make sure you, you support a veteran or you grace a veteran so today, to, today, tomorrow, yesterday by visiting www.gracesarmaheroes.com. We got to change the way we eat. We got to change the way we live. And we got to change the way we treat each other because it's on us to do what we got to do to survive. No doubt. Until next time, peace. Peace. What's up, everybody? Me again, Adrian. Johnny. And of course, see someone missing. Ms. Amber Travis. We would like to wish her well. Amber's moving on in her career. She's taking a leap of faith to a new milestone. And we would like to wish her nothing but the best. And may God bless her.